So first of all, Ramon, it's a, it's a huge pleasure to be able to interview you. So thank you so much for uh, being here. Uh, I thought we could start right at the beginning. So you used to be a lawyer in pa Palencia. So how did you make the transition from a lawyer to football? When I was a kid, I say it is normal. What I wanted to be is a player, not <laughs> a director of a president. But um, I hadn't skill enough to do that. And uh, I became a lawyer, as you said. I came to Madrid after being two years in London, working as a lawyer also. And then I started to be involved in the life of the club. I became a member and uh, finally I joined the board of directors. And finally, I was the president from 2006 and 2009. Uh, I'm very proud of that. It's a, it's a great responsibility, as you know, because uh, millions around the world are really looking at you, looking at what you are doing. And uh, they are really happy when we win, but they are very, very sad when we are losing. And uh, in our club, to win is an obligation. That's a problem because um, uh, you cannot win always, but uh, as in other clubs, to win is a joy, it's happiness. Uh, here is an obligation. That's why this club is so successful. It's very demanding in any sense. And uh, that's why in the last 47 years, only one coach, Del Bosque, has been more than three years in, in our bench. That means how difficult how much pressure has this club, even today Zidane has announced that he leaves, he leaves the club Yeah. today. Yeah. So that, that in, he's been the most successful coach of our history. But uh, the criticism is, uh, is too high in some cases and he's decided to leave. <clears throat> yeah, that's true. It's one of the greatest clubs in the world. Um, growing up in Palencia, did you support them as a kid and did you ever imagine that you would actually become the president of Real Madrid? Of course not. As <laughs> I told you, my idea was to be a player yeah. <laughs> and I couldn't. I haven't talent and skill for, for that and so I, the other things in life come little by little. You, you don't really imagine what you are going to be when you are grown up in any sense and of course in in this case, being the president of Real Madrid wasn't in my dreams. Mm.